Alright guys, welcome back to another episode. I'm your host T and welcome to TNT Gaming. Now today we are checking out Crisis Core, Final Fantasy VII Reunion, in which this is the new trailer that just launched and I'm super excited about this. I'm mainly excited about this because back in the day when Crisis Core came out, I never got a chance to play it. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Let's check it out and uh, let's see what's going on. Those wings, I want them too. Oh, the company has decided to eliminate Genesis and his cohorts. This includes Angeal as well. Wow. That sword represents our family's honor. I see. No wonder. I've become a monster. A monster's Whoa. objective is usually world domination or revenge. I told you. You can't live on that side anymore. Is that Angeal's face? It appears Genesis isn't the only one who can be copied. The mysterious gift of the goddess. What is the meaning behind it? For us, at least. Oh man, this this game already it looks beautiful and I can already feel that it's gonna it's probably gonna be like incredibly emotional, but I'm ready for it. Oh, they got the chocobo in there. <laughs> Those soldier people are kind of weird. They fight and they love it. If only I were soldier. Soldier is oh, like wow. a den of monsters. Don't go inside. Do you remember what I said about our enemy being all that creates suffering? But I created my own suffering. You want to do something to me, eh? But then, who will stop Genesis and Angeal's degradation? If this world seeks my destruction, it goes with me. Am I a human being? Shinra, soldier, and you. I hate you all! Severoth! Why did you kill the townspeople? Why did you hurt Tifa? Answer me, Sephiroth! Wow. Sephiroth! The army's mobilizing. Find the targets before they do. I want them alive. You hear me? Roger. All right, let's get going. Will I oh, that's cool. see you again? Hey, Cloud. I... I have to go to Midgar. <laughs> wow. So, as I said before, I think this is going to be an incredibly emotional uh, game. And it's really cool. I think it's really cool how they're linking all like all the characters and the full story of Final Fantasy all together. And uh, as I said before, I never got a chance to play this uh, game in the past. And so I'm not too familiar with all the characters that are in there. And I've been trying to for God knows how long been trying to avoid the spoilers of everybody talking about it and, and some of the things that have came in there so uh so yeah i'm super excited you know i'm definitely going to be going into this blind and after watching this trailer it's letting me know that it's going to be a complete emotional roller coaster one of the things that i really did like was how they are more or less humanizing sephiroth because for for as long as i've been playing final fantasy uh, and have known of you know the Final Fantasy 7 universe Sephiroth has always been like this evil heartless bad guy and so I think it's really cool that they're showing a different side of him as well as some of the other uh, back characters in the game and and I, I think it just I don't know for me it just it feels more complete I guess with the Final Fantasy 7 universe so I am absolutely stoked for it I definitely will be purchasing this on day one and uh, and probably live streaming it as well but guys let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section and of course if you're new to the channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button for more content and I'll see you guys next time peace